Ninja, it is time for your final training. You hold two powerful katana in your hands. Use them wisely. First, we will learn how to attack. The amount of damage is determined by the strength of your swing. The key is to swing fast and hard. Now, use a powerful swing to cut these bamboo mats. Enemies have weak spots. Different enemies have different weak spots. Strike swiftly at these spots to do critical damage. Now use what you have just learned to strike all the bamboo mats. To succeed in battle, you must also block. Place your blade where the enemy is striking to block their blade. An enemy may attack you up close or from far away. You can use your weapons to block swords and projectiles. Place your sword in front of the enemy's weapon before it strikes you to block it. Your training partner in front of you will now attack. Block his attack with your sword. Enemies will strike you with different attacks. Place your weapon in front of the enemy's weapon before it strikes you to block it. Your training partner in front of you will now swing from the right Block his attack with your sword. With some enemies, it is best to attack immediately after you block their attack. Your training partner in front of you will now attack. Block his attack with your sword and then attack him. Some enemies will throw projectiles like ninja stars or kunai at you. You can block these projectiles with your weapon. Your training partner will now throw some kunai at you. Try to block them with your sword. Some projectiles can be hit back at the enemy that threw it. With proper timing, you can use your enemy's projectile against them. Your training partner will now throw some ninja stars at you. Try to hit them back with your sword. Now, let's combine your attacking and blocking skills. Your training partners will now attack you. Use your blocking and attacking skills that you have learned to eliminate them. Fight. You can track your health by looking at your health meter. You can find this by looking down towards your feet. Take a look now. Your health meter is shown in red. As you take damage, it will decrease. You are now ready to fight. Enemies are coming. Get ready.
Triple kill. Double kill. Double kill. Congratulations on unlocking the ancient power of the Shadow Scrolls. You must now learn how to harness the Shadow Skills that these scrolls embody. The second meter below your red health meter is your Shadow Skill meter. If you have a Shadow Skill equipped, killing enemies will fill up this meter with blue Shadow Focus. The Shadow Skill Meter is divided into three tiers. Once Tier 1 is filled, you can summon your skill by pulling both trigger buttons. As you fill up each tier, the skill will be more powerful when you use it. Tier 3 will be the most powerful version of your Shadow Skill. Here in the Training Dojo, we'll fill your Shadow Skill Meter for you to practice your abilities. Your first shadow skill is the Shadow Bow. With this skill, you can summon a bow and arrow that you can use to defeat enemies at a distance. Pull both your triggers to summon your Shadow Bow. Hit the enemy in the distance. You'll notice that time slows down while your shadow skill is triggered. This will happen with every shadow skill you unlock. During combat, when you fill up three tiers of Shadow Focus, 
You'll have the ability to shoot three arrows when you trigger that ability. To shoot the arrow, knock the arrow into the bow by pulling the trigger that is holding the arrow while it is close to the bow string. Give it a try now. Triple kill.
Double kill. Blocking Master.
Yo, 